Hard to do. Same as part one, so your right hand is now in your middle C, the left hand went down two octaves down there. Um, and it's just the, the first part, or the first half. Um, that's the same, and then you're gonna go to this part. Sorry. Still, we're all we're just in this uh, uh, B minor scale, um, just sort of playing around with that. But you have G, B, A, so that's your first little thing, and then you're in position. So it's like a little finger exercise, you know. I mean, it's really it's just skipping notes. Starting on C is what I meant to say, we start on C. So. Then you have a big rest, small rest, 16th rest. Um, so watch this, you have uh, F sharp on the top the whole time, a sharp on the bottom the whole time, and the middle note is going to change. So the chords look like this, E, D sharp, D, C sharp, C, and then you end on a B. And you... And in the left hand, uh, you're doing exactly the same thing, except no A sharp. So you got F sharp on top the whole time and you're mimicking this thing. You go E, D sharp, D, C sharp, C, and then you do a B power chord. So you're going, starting with this F sharp, and you go. Okay. The last part, one more little pattern. This is the fun part. Oh, sorry, my bad. What am I doing? I'm reaching under you. <laughs> power chord, B power chord, E power chord, B, E, B. So this is going to be the same thing all the way up. Uh, we are sw switching minor modes, but don't worry about that too much. So the first position you go G, B, A sharp, C sharp, then you switch here, B, D, C sharp, E, then you're going to go up here, D, F sharp, thumb to E. G sharp, F sharp, A sharp, G sharp, B. So that's the whole pattern, and you do it two more times. But um, so basically, if you just do this, G A sharp, B C sharp, and here, and then this is here. So you have 
really nice sounding, but that teaches your hand to just kind of move. Okay? Does that make sense? And then you start over on this octave. Six chord, a B minor with a G sharp, and all I'm doing is playing it over and over. This time, though, we're going to skip the D and just hit B and then bounce right back from left hand over to D. So effect and then there's a couple more chords it's the G major you can see G major here but you have B on the bottom G and D on the top and then you're gonna do some B minors so B power chord D B it's a really great voicing of a minor chord or a major chord putting the one and the five here three here root up there and you go third section. Really want 